It's Lifestyle Fridays, and this week we are challenging you to vote. Vote! <laughs> November 6th. Do it. <laughs> next week, like Laura said, November 6th, and we cannot stress to you how important it is for you all to exercise your right to vote. It's important to vote in general, but for those of us passionate about the environment, it's especially important. Personal actions are great and they definitely help, but in the end, legislation and political activities is the only thing that can really help save our planet say by capping carbon emissions or stopping a dangerous pipeline from being built. Yeah, a lot of people are skeptical about politicians and the promises they make and what they can actually do for us, but our past leaders have actually passed some really important environmental legislation like the Clean Air Act, the Clean Water Act, and the National Environmental Protection Act. So support politicians who are willing to make the tough decisions to deal with climate change. This means staying up to date and educated on the issues and also knowing how different candidates feel about them. So like Laura said, education is key and a great way to research the issues and how the candidates feel about the issues is through nonpartisan, unbiased, straightforward organizations. And that way you can come to your own conclusions about how you feel about the issues instead of listening to someone else I guess their own opinion because that's how a lot of news organizations are so that's why it's important to research through non-biased yeah, organizations. Yep. So come on people, we want to see you all out there November 6th voting. And we've linked down below some nonpartisan websites to help you make your own educated decisions on who you want to vote for this presidential election. Yay! Dance party! Dance party!